Yes, uh, what we have here is a RV-10 that we picked up from a previous customer about a year and a half ago. Since we've got it, we've uh, put a new engine in it. This particular engine has got an LS3 engine in it with an MSD Atomic ECU system. It uh, has the original gearbox in the, in the airplane that was on the old engine. This LS3 is going to put out right about 370 horsepower at 4,500 RPM for a maximum takeoff performance. Normal cruise is going to be somewhere around 36 to 3,000 RPM. At that point, uh, it's going to burn roughly 20 to 30 percent less fuel per hour than an air-cooled engine putting out the same horsepower and we will burn almost no oil. We don't put a lot of, add a lot of oil to this, air, to this engine, particularly not between flights. So that saves a lot of money right there, as well as the fuel costs. Everything in here is uh, pretty much off the shelf components for maintenance uh, that you can get almost anywhere. So uh, maintenance costs are very, very low on this airplane. One of the things we're, we're most known for is our, our uh, centrifugal clutch system. Right now, it's disengaged and this prop will spin freely. In our, in our system, we use dual radiators, one on each side, uh, with air scoops over here on the, on the outside of, of the cowling instead of up here. We actually block these off. Air is uh, forced through that radiator at a higher velocity due to better cooling. The gearbox runs on its own lubrication system, its own lubricant. We don't mix engine oil with the gears. That would be like putting engine oil in the differential of your car. We expect to be able to get with regular maintenance, 3,000 hours out of the gearbox, 3,000 hours out of the engine. When you're done, then you get yourself a, a new long block, transfer everything over, and you got a brand new zero time engine for about $4,000.
miles to the south. We're going to enter on the left downwind for 17 northwest. Let's get to 4,000 and see what kind of level speed we can get at a higher power setting. Don't want to make my way too far from the airport. Uh, we're located on the Hillsboro, Texas Municipal Airport. If you don't know where that is, you can look up uh, KINJ for airport identifier. Otherwise, we're 45 miles south of Fort Worth, Texas, uh, right off I-35W. When you drive down here, you'll see the, the sign out by the billboard out by the highway for the skydiving school. When you see that, you're here. We'll be at Oshkosh again this year. Uh, every year we uh, go to uh, booth 625 in the North Aircraft Display Area. We plan to have this airplane on display in that booth for this year and many years to come. Other than that, you can come visit us at autopsrus.com. <laughs>